the filming of my last video at camp, I hand Alana the phone to capture the part where I was putting the, the tarp under the, the tent. And when I hand her the video, the video, instead of capturing like this way, it went upside down. So I had to go into idiots and try to fix it. But I, before I go into idiots to try to fix it, I went online and I searched and I searched and I could not find a proper video that would fix this problem because most of the video was done and there was no uh, audible explanation. They were just um, doing it and uh, I couldn't understand because there were different programs and most of it was done in Hindi and I don't really speak Hindi. So I found a problem and I'm going to show you how to fix it because we as content creator, when we flim and we have to fix the problem, we have to go into programs to fi fix it and we don't have the time to go on different platform to find out what is the problem. So this is where I'm going to fix it and I'm going to show you how to do it in idiots. All right, so let's go and get it done. This is the video screen in ADS. So what we're going to do now is you have to open your window and pull in all your files. And when you do that, the window is going to look like this and you create a new folder and you save your folder and then you have to draw you have to drag the file onto the timeline so let me show you how you're gonna so the file is here see the file there how it look it's like upside it down so that file we're gonna drag on the timeline so this is the the bigger screen because I have two screen and I'm gonna drag the file and I'm gonna put it on the timeline there I do it a split that the audio can go in one and the video clip could go in one so once you have it there and you bring it up you can see it here now you could see it much better how it look here see it's flipped there so now we have to turn the video from a vertical standpoint to a horizontal. That's how you normally shoot a video. So I'm going to show you how I flip First it. First step you have to do is go on clip. And after you go on clip, then you go to layer out. See right there? And after you do that, you're going to come to this window. And once you come to that window, the next thing you're going to do is look for the rotate button. So I'm going to show you that just now. So once you see that window now, we're going to look here. There is a bar here that you could see the bar that goes up and down. See here, the bar goes up and down and then you're going to look for rotate. And you see the word rotate there? That's where you go to rotate and here this is where you're gonna turn the video so you see when you move it the video turn there and it turn as you turn it here on the small screen it also turn on the big screen let me show you uh, let me show you here so as you see it turn there you're gonna see it turn on both screens look as you turn it, it's going to turn on both screens. See? And you turn and you position it the right way. And look here. You could see it positioned right the right way now. And this is the big screen where you see the video is turned correctly. 
all right so let's pull it out because when you turn it if you notice the whole screen is black so we have to pull it out to get the whole screen with the video you see when you turn the video now it's gonna have a black border you're gonna see it as you turn it there and on the biggest screen you're gonna see it with the big black border so we have to fix that now we have to stretch the video or pull it out so it would cover the whole screen the whole frame there that blue frame so let me show you how we're gonna fix that so we're gonna go back right here on this screen so I could show you properly so what you do now at the end um at the four corners of of the video itself has arrows or borders point that you could pull out so once you hold these four corners and you pull out you see it would drag out as big as you want and then you pull it to the end of the screen until you don't see any more black borders and that's how you get it so when you pull it like this on the small screen you could see it's positioned on the next screen and it's bigger it's full the screen now and that's what you want to accomplish so you flip the whole video from an upside down state to this all right that's the main goal there now and then i'm going to show you how i'm going to take a video clip so we could do it later so to do a recap we make sure that we go to clip and then we're gonna go to layer all right so let me close this window we're gonna close this window now because the video is already turned and um, at the bottom here we're gonna click OK see it have OK there when you click okay it comes on the big window so once it come on the big window now we could do our editing now so we come to the timeline and we could move the video see the video is fixed and that's how i was trying to fix the tarp and roll it you push it on the rock so we're trying to put the tarp down now so instead of lifting up the tent i decided by god's grace from god's wisdom that we could just roll it out good you ready to rock you ready to roll out i am rolling yeah I can't reach it my push it on the rock. So we're trying to put the tarp down now. So instead of lifting up the tent, I decided by God's grace, from God's wisdom, that we could just roll it out. Good. You ready to rock? You ready to roll out? I am rolling, yeah. I can't reach it, my.